Right, the dry brushing has now taken place, as has the basing and grassing. That over there is the church. I try to keep it very subtle, so not not very harsh dry brushing in terms of going from dark brown to kind of desert colour. There were four or five levels of dry brush, but it looks more realistic. I'm not sure what to do about signs. I suppose you can print out, you know, saloon and that kind of thing using fonts on the web, but I think I don't know how to look. Also, I suppose in the game, you know, you might not want to have the building as a saloon each time. It's only occurred to me now that I could have had a little kind of slot throughs where you change the name of whatever it says in the building. But you know, for example, this might be the bank in one game rather than whatever the hell I call it. Yeah, that's the only piece of architectural interest that I made. That kind of gable thing <laughs> using as a template uh, one of the push through cardboard cutout bits from Space Hulk just to trace that kind of shape. Yeah, that'll be the gel house. You see, everything is the same colour, which I don't know how it looks, but I wasn't sure what else to do. Because it does look quite cool that the gel house is a different colour. And this is the final building over here. So you can just see little bits of bush sort of stuck here and there and some grass. <laughs>